Some call it a symbol of religious freedom. Others, a big black eye for Arizona. The ever controversial Senate Bill 1062 is headed to the governor's desk tonight. If signed, it would protect businesses from being sued after turning away customers for being gay. Nine on your sides, Maggie Vespa joins us now with more. That's right, guys. Stella, this hot button bill passed the state Senate yesterday, and a few hours ago, the House followed suit with a vote of 33 to 27. Tonight, both sides say, though, this fight is far from over. We're just happy that any customer will come through the door. A mere hypothetical a few weeks back turned near reality today in Phoenix. House Democrats, all of whom voted against the bill today, call it disgraceful. It's really a bill that is. Um, that is sanctioning discrimination in our state um, to the guise and veil of uh, religious freedom. Just like uh, blacks were afforded, uh, it was legal for them to be discriminated against and not be served at a lunch counter in Birmingham, Alabama, and other places. The Arizona ACLU says it puts the state, quote, on the wrong side of history and compares it to SB 1070, also known as Arizona's Show Me Your Papers law. Which some worry will cost the state its Super Bowl dreams slated for next year. But supporters of 1062, namely its sponsor, Senator Steve Yarbrough, say opponents are distorting the bill, telling our sister station, KNXV, it's about respecting beliefs of all Arizonans. With the directors of the Center for Arizona Policy adding, quote, we see a growing hostility toward religion. Now, Governor Brewer vetoed a bill similar to this one last year, saying she wanted lawmakers to focus instead on Medicaid reform, but she has given no indication what she will do this time around. Live in the newsroom, I'm Maggie Vespa, KGON 9 on your side.